When you are considering having a child with cystic fibrosis, one of the important things to think about is the genetics. To have cystic fibrosis, you need two copies of the abnormal CF gene, and the mother will naturally pass one copy to the baby. So it depends on whether or not the father has a copy of the CF gene as to whether the baby will ultimately have one. And therefore, it's important to test the partner before the pregnancy is conceived. So if the father does not have a copy of the CF gene, then all children born to that couple will in fact be carriers of the mother's gene. And for the child itself, that doesn't matter at all until that child themselves considers having children. And then again, you would have the option of testing that child's partner to see whether they were a carrier. If the partner is found to carry the CF gene, and about one in 25 people do carry the CF gene, then there's a 50-50 chance that the baby will have cystic fibrosis. There is a technique called pre-implantation genetic diagnosis that helps to get round this, where you can test the embryo to see whether it carries cystic fibrosis. And if it does, you don't implant that embryo. And you look for another one that is just a carrier and implant that embryo into the mother's womb.